Hello, I'm Edgeless and welcome back to our lovely moon base place. Moon base place. Ooh, I like that. Um, unfortunately, we've had a bad run of luck. Both of our workers are injured, although they are going uh, to get fixed up now. We're also having some food problems because, well, our biologist died very early on. How we do a biologist now, and they are going to be starting work. But we just need our food quickly, and I don't know if that's going to happen quick enough for us. Uh, I would like to put down a wheat pad, potato pad, and first aid pad. The reason I want the first aid pad is straight up, we're going to be using two of our five medicine. We're going to go through it too quickly if that happens again. More people get injured in the mines, we're going to need it. Alright, so let's get the speed on. Ooh, we also need to probably start storing stuff. We don't have a storage space. That said, do we have enough, like, resources to do that? Probably not. Yeah, that's a worker. I'm going to turn off comments for the time being, because I just don't think I have enough to support them. And I know power's really an issue, but again, I don't have much in the way of, like, stuff. Like, that's it for a lot of the important things that we need. Uh, I'm going to have to put in a biofabricator. And... Come on... Morning! Right, turn, 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 turn. There we go, finally. Ooh, we are drawing quite a lot of power. Big concern is still the fact we have basically no food. We almost have food, though. Very close to having food. So we might still be able to just about come out of this. I hope. There goes the last meal. Yes. Meal makers making meals. We have meals. Go, go, go. People, start eating. Yes, another meal. Go. Now, the thing is, we don't have a storage space at the moment, so we're going to have to just try and make some resources quickly. Okay, that work is healed. Yes, go to the mines. You just keep running back and forth because for whatever reason. Oh, you're hungry. Oh, that might you know make sense. Um, I'm prioritize this room because I would like stuff to be built as soon as possible, without any like. Oh, I could delete this. I could delete the bed because no one's injured. And I get full monies back for it. So yes, I will delete, delete that. Um, is there anything else I'd like to delete? I could delete this for more steel. I can turn it off temporarily. That'll save us a lot of power, actually. It means no traders, but it's probably worthwhile. Let's check our power situation. Base management. Uh, no, not that. Charts. Show me power balance. We're not getting to peak. That, that to me, looks like we're not getting to peak. Yeah. Uh oh, we've trapped someone outside. Hopefully they've got enough O2 to get through the night. Because that's quite a lot of the night that we've got left. So you know what? We're going to take this apart. And we're going to put in uh, another solar panel. How much do we have? We've got seven metal. I could put in a giant solar panel, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to put in a uh, medium-sized one. Boop. At least you're making yourself useful while you're outside. 
That helps. You can go inside for water now. It's okay. I'll let you. I'm not that harsh with Tasman. Oh my god, you went back to work? You're dehydrating, and yet... Okay. Well, fair enough. To each their own. Kitty, don't eat all the boxes. The boxes are not for you. The boxes contain, like, my new computer. Oh god, 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 wrong one, wrong one, panicking, 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 panicking. Yellow alert, go, 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 go. Get inside now. Oh. Oh, my panicking nearly killed us. Not enough water's annoying as well. Food stocks are running low. Can't do anything about that without water. Question is, what does water things use? Just metal? In which case we can go large. Build a big one and we'll delete the odd one. Do not eat the box. I'm going to put the box on my lap. There we go. That's really uncomfortable. It's quite a large box. You can go outside now. No one got radiation poisoning, which is great, because I, I was suspecting that would happen. Uh-oh. Looks like we're going to have some problems with the food. Come, biologist. Be quick. We're going to need you. No, that, that one's not going to be ready soon. You need to work on something that's going to be ready soon. That's also not going to be ready soon. In fact, quite a lot of them are not going to be ready soon. Oh, at least there's food coming. Yes! Right, and we're going to delete that. Save us a little bit of power and also give us one metal bag. Right, we need a storage room. Storage, 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 storage. Paolo, I can't do anything about that right now. Storage, storage, storage. There we go. Probably put the storage here. And it'll have to be a small one for now. Of course we've run out of food. Well, it's going to shut down. I can shut down the mine. Maybe I should shut down the mine at night. Questions. Did we reach peak power yesterday? I don't think we did. Peak power will be up to like 7.5k. So, we might have been able to make it through the night. Maybe. Still, turning off the mine at night is probably not a bad idea. Okay, we would like food any minute now. Okay, we've got some coming through here. Some coming through here. Some coming through here. in those machines, so we're not creating any new resources, which we kind of desperately need. Um, more food? Good! We're finally getting some food in. We might just make it out of this. Maybe. I wish you could go to supplies, by the way, and be like, I set the only thing to be stored in here. Like, you could have a list of things that you can store in a supply depot, so that you could put, like, food supplies next to this, and you can put, like, resource supplies next to, you know, places that need to be able to create them. Medical supplies up near the... It would be... It would just be useful. I feel that that would be an important part of the game, because it would help the AI with pathfinding. We've gone through our food pretty quick, but I think we're expecting some more soon. Yeah. 
Actually, not that much. Okay, we need another steel there, and I need two more bio. I'm getting there. Hopefully just no one dies, right? And I've got meals in the meal maker. Power storage is low. Okay, we definitely hit peak. So we need more we need more storage. And I can't do that because that involves more metal. Um Turn off the mine to try and lengthen that time we have. Not enough. Damn. Okay. Let's just creep through the night. And power, power. So let's just double check. Yeah, we definitely heat peak power there. We just opened up storage. So that'll be something we have to do when we've got more steel. But the problem is that takes a lot of steel. Like, we need like four or five steel, really. We need one more bio and we can create the storage. Bam, we can create the storage. Right. Bed in there. Healy bed in here. Whoa! God damn it! Well, at least we weren't going to be using that room for a little while. <sighs> we'll be able to fix it when we've got some metal, but for now, eh. I oh, know we don't even need metal, we just need to fix it? What? That's awesome, okay. That simplifies things a lot. Um, I would like to build a power collector. Um... I mean, I should build it in ridiculous size, but I, I need it soon. So I'm going to have to build it in a small size. Which frustrates me, because it's not optimal by any means, but we'll do it. And I'm going to turn off the mine to save power throughout the night, since no one's in there anyway at the moment. We're a third through the power, only just got through a uh, third of the night, so I think we're probably going to die. Yep, we're going we're gonna to lose power. We're not going to die, die, but we're definitely going to lose some power. Force the airlock off. Otherwise people might get trapped outside. And if people get trapped outside and then we have a, a solar flare, that would be very bad for us. There we go. We'll just enable these again. Nearly at the end of the night. Come on, Nelly. Okay. How do for food? Still, still barely in there with the production rate meeting the demand. It would be useful to have more. Get some maze going. Yes, I know the food stocks are low. Thank you for that one. And part of the issue is overnight the water is turning off and thus the food supplies are like dying. That's hopefully something we'll be able to address.
Ugh, cold tea. Ugh. Ugh. That's from when you don't have any power. Okay. We're almost getting there on the amount of steel we have to be able to build this. I think we need, what, two steel? We've got enough ore in here to provide for that. So we can shut this down to save on power as soon as night arrives. There we go. I'm going to try and shut down everything I can to save on power. Because I don't want my crops to die during the night as well. What's the usage like currently? We are so going quickly. Way too quick. I don't think we're going to be able to even remotely think about getting through this night. Almost, but we're still ahead of things. We're still ahead of things. We need to shut down more. No sleepies. No oxygen. It's going to be close. I think we may have it. Uh, no, no, I don't think we have it. I think I may have spoken too soon. I think we might have enough metal now to build it. Yes, we do. Build, 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 build. Come on, engineer. Get over here. Huzzah! Basically doubled our storage, so we should be fine from now on. Okay, um... That will hopefully solve the power problems, which should solve our food problems, in theory. Um, what do we want to do next? Probably put down... A lab. Because I can use that to grow food. I want to run it off of here. Can I not? Oh, I can't. There is a... Because I want it near the med bay. The reason for that is uh, we can make more medicine there, which we do need to do. But we can also, in the meantime, while we're not making medicine, make food using our medics. Which suits me fine. Okay, I think we might also be in the region for expanding soon as well. So we'll get down a landing pad. We've got oxygen of 20 people, we've only got 7 at the moment. So we can probably double our size almost. I wouldn't say fully double. I'd be iffy about a couple of these things, but we'll see. But we do have the meals. Which is making me happy. Happy, happy, happy. I'm so happy. In a rich man's world. Uh, all the steel that I want up there is going down here. I'm temporarily delete that. Just so the steel gets rerouted. So one thing gets completed. And then the other thing. Rather than just both of them being waiting on. Waiting on. Waiting on. And like get built in like a billion years time. But I think we should be able to build the lab today. Come on, lab. That's one steel. We need a second steel. Come on! Come on! Come on! It's going to take a little while.
And you leave it. Okay. Holding for power. We've got through the night with about half our power supply left in one of them. Which is actually surprisingly uh, quite a lot of power. We, we were draining 150% when we had one battery. And the battery just couldn't take it. So we got two thirds through the night. Um, we don't have a lot spare. We have some. We don't have a lot. Come on, get us that steel. I want that lab. Yes! Okay, we have steel. Go! Someone grab the steel. Go, go grab the steel and make the lab. Make the lab! I believe in you. I believe in you! Come on! Get out of here. Come on, I know you can do it. Little robot thing, I believe in you. And then we just need an engineer. To take the long trek. By the way, if, we, if our engineer dies, we're screwed. Because we won't have anyone to build the starport to call in another engineer. Oh crap, we totally need to build that star. The, what's it called? Spaceport? It's not spaceport, it's... Landing pad, that's it. Yeah, we need to build you. Because I've only just realised what a precarious situation we're in. Well, I knew we were in a precarious situation. Quite how precarious situation was went over my head. And you, really, you're going back into... Ah! We're going to end the episode here. I've been Andrew Lizzie. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. If you're not subscribed, please... Ooh, if I shut down this, will he go do his job outside? Yes! Anyway, I've been Andrew Elysium. Uh, if you've liked, please like and not subscribe. Please consider subscribing. If you like how I treat my uh, lovely colonist employees, um, let me know down below. There we go. You can come back in now. No, you will stay outside and suffer from, like, oxygen deprivation and dehydration until you've done your job. Uh, yeah, until next time, though, stay shiny.